The training we're doing here today is basic riot control, crowd control formations. The training is important because you never really know what's gonna happen. If you're in a situation and you come across a, a hostile crowd that they may not have lethal means, but they're, they're causing some sort of disturbance in front of you. Um, you need to know on uh, how to conduct yourself, how to disperse that crowd without being hostile. It's, it's a tool that you can use without having to engage a crowd with lethal means. What riot control and crowd control will be used for is anytime you have a hostile situation um, where you have an active crowd or, or an active personnel that, that don't want to disperse from a certain area or if you just need to show a force to get a crowd to disperse, that's when you would use riot control, crowd control. The exercise that we were doing was the basic shield line, and then behind the shield line, you have uh, what we call snatch teams. Uh, usually it's a five-man team. Once you engage the crowd or engage an individual that's out in front of the shield line and they come down to the ground, you'd send a snatch team out. Uh, the snatch team, their basic job is to provide security for the members behind them and to uh, restrain that individual that's out in front of them. Non-lethal training gives commanders an option that they can use. It's, it's a tool that they can put in their in their book so they don't have to engage someone with lethal means. It, it gives them that, that extra option to, to use. That's what we bring to the table.